doesn't taste it. I'm not allowed to touch it. Look at top part three here. Beautiful. There's a tea room for Fesho Lively. Beautiful, isn't it? Have a look at your, have a look at this cutlery. Please do not touch. Beautiful shade. Lively. This was original bed chamber and was part of the 16th century mansion built by Oli Pant, the last owner of the house. Hughes and Mary Lodima do this as a winter sitting room, and a five page shell book and magazine were aired by them. Please put it, my friend, if you have time. Our interest in the picture who is who? Number two, Thomas Reed, 1870 to 90 by Hannah Rotima. Professional elder daughter, this is the copy of Rayburn portrait which can be found at Fife Castle, Fifey Castle. That's a painting. A figure. See the seal, isn't it? You can read if you want. Please put read, I can read. Thank you. 
This is you to be their library. And uh, that's a lot of Anyway, I will write you see the, uh, the plaster ceiling of plaster. Look, look. Beautiful, isn't it? You can see the somebody face there. Beautiful, isn't it? I think. Can't go up there. Come in, go back. I haven't seen a photograph of this. I like painting. And the figure. Like own own furniture, own thing. Is oh, the, you know how one of the son, sculptor, painter, architect in the family, they stay furniture, they make themselves. I did the step is quite quite big. Hi, good afternoon. I said my this plaster the ceiling. Could you tell me a bit about the painting, please? About the painting? Yeah, you um, know about the painting. Yes, but the painting here is by Jakob de Witt. Uh -huh. uh, painted in 1676. And the title is The Apotheosis of Hercules. So Hercules is being greeted. He's the one with his back to us in the club. You see the Hercules, this one here? The one with the crown, wearing crowns of Hercules? Well, the, crown, the one with the crown is um, um, Zeus, king of the gods. Zeus, king of god. And uh, Hercules is the one with his back to us. Oh, yeah. With yeah. the club. And he's being greeted by Mercury. And he's going to be inducted as a God, uh -huh. Mount Olympus. And the lady behind the... Uh... Well, now, the lady uh, behind Mercury, I think... The one with the flower on her head, the white... The one with the flowers in... Right, the one um, we've got here. Mars. See this one here? Look at the camera, look. Oh. Uh, the one there. Oh, the one there. I that one is Diana. 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 Then you've got the one below her, is Venus. See the one naked one. Yep. Uh -huh. And then the other naked one on the right here. Uh huh. That is Juno. Juno. Uh huh. And you've got Cupid um, on beside Venus, and Mars is the one is the uh, the god with the helmet on. Ah, uh, that's God. Yeah, and then you have Neptune with the um, uh, three-pointed uh, spear. Yeah, that's Neptune. Mm -hmm. And then behind him is Thor. Thor. Is it, is it, no, it's yeah. Vul Vulcan. Vulcan. I'm uh -huh. getting, getting... Thor, right. the one with the hammer. That's yeah. Thor, yeah. That was, that's Vulcan. Neck, neck to the naked lady. And the neck, yeah, above the naked lady. Uh -huh. And this one here... That one, that that is that is Hercules. Uh huh. Oh. And then round about, you've got birds and bird. animals. Now the birds. Black uh, bird. Yeah, the probably crows or rooks. Crow. The two, uh, those um, the birds and the and the stork on on the other side, the uh -huh. white bird. They indicate or they signify transcendency. Transcendency from the so it's hell. Over, transcendency over over problems, or, you know. Yeah. And difficulty. Difficulty. Then the, pe the peacock mm -hmm. stands for long life. P 
pea coat, the one here, stand for long life. Yeah. Black pea coat. Yeah. Yes. See, just see his crown. Mm-hmm. You're and a crown. A, on this side here, uh -huh. the notes talk about bears. Okay? Bear. They don't, don't look like bears to me. No, they look like dog. And bears stand for rebirth. 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 Renew. Interesting. And, and the dog, the Spaniel. Dogs for loyalty. For loyalty. And because the king mm -hmm. is Charles II, uh -huh. they have to be Spaniels. They have to Spaniel. Yes, Spaniels, because that was his favorite dog. Ah. So what that, there's a, that, those animals create a little message, wishing the king long life on his Loy. throne. Uh -huh. And this, this family are loyal to him. Loyal, yes. And look at the plaster ceiling, madam. Yeah, look at this. this. Yeah, it's, it's, it's a wonderful ceiling. It's beautiful. Um, oh, I've got a so naked look. Could you imagine doing this? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I know. Uh, you're up there, you know, some of it is molded and some of it is freestyle. The molded um, one, you could do it and then plate it up. Yeah, and then plate it up. And then yeah. the one you freestyle, you have to storm oh, these yeah, men. Yeah. They have to cry. Yeah. Now, this side is very full. Uh -huh. uh, and, and um, vibrant, uh -huh. but that side is flatter, and it's because this side got damaged and had to be repaired. Oh, right, true. It looked yeah. flatter, yeah. Because you can see that there's a little dip mm -hmm. in 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 the cornicing there uh -huh. and the crack going up. Yeah, the crack there. Yeah. Uh -huh. yeah. There's some men here. The crack here. Uh -huh. but and did this size full again? Yes, that size full again. Uh -huh. um, when the house was um, empty for about 60, 70 years. 60, 70 years? Yeah. That's long um, time to be empty. Yeah, uh, a lot of water came through the roof. Why are they empty? Why are they, they not? The Earl of Mar and Kelly, who took over the property and the title uh -huh. in 1828, decided this house was surplus to requirements. Uh -huh. He had better houses elsewhere, ah. but he wanted the estate, so he sold everything in the house and left it empty. Left it empty. This bedroom, who bedroom this? Now, this would have been Alexander Erskine, the third Earl's chamber. And then subsequently, it became known as the Countess's bedroom. Countess bedroom. That's yeah. why it's pur purple. Well, not so much that. It was, it was um, uh, the color uh, scheme here was devised by Mary Lorimer, uh, the last lady Daughter. to live. Yes, yeah, to uh -huh. live in the house. Mm -hmm. um, and what she was doing here was trying to bring the colors of the garden into. Ah. The, the bedroom. room. Mm -hmm. So I, I guess it's they, the family with, sorry, you might be in a... No, no. Yeah. The family with six children. One of them is architect. One of them is... Now. This one is the... the you had professor, the professor and his wife. Uh-huh. They would have had this bedroom. Yes. Then their first son, John Henry, was uh -huh. the painter. Yes. Uh, then Robert, at, at their son, was the architect. Architect. This one is a furniture. That's the furniture, yes. The architect wants furniture. For, for the furniture. Furniture one as well. Yes. The commode. Yes. At the side there mm -hmm. is, is a piece of his design. I've seen a lot of furniture he designed down next door. Mm. And also I know they designed the, a little thing like that and like that and also like this. No, this, this not, is, no. No, that's no, not. No. Oh, Roberts, the, that, the, that they designed that. They designed that. Uh -huh. Yeah, designed that. Uh -huh. And designed the mirror. The mirror. Yeah. Uh -huh. This is Robert designed by the. Yeah. It's a no. third son or. It was the second son. Second son. No, he wasn't. He was the third son. Third right? son. Third uh -huh. son. Um, then the sculptor. Mm -hmm. The sculpture. Yes. Sculptor. Hugh, Hugh was Robert's son. Robert's son. Robert's ah, son. And that's his the, wife Mary was the one. That's that second generation done. Yes, second generation. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. Yes. Very nice. I I let you. This is this is nice bed. Nice car. Oh, it's a it's a day bed. It's a day bed. Day, day bed. And mm -hmm. that it should be that way up. So oh. you can see the ceiling <laughs> without ah. getting a crick in your Okay. Neck. <laughs> Thanks very much for for your help. Yes. Thank you for your that's information. Thank you pleasure. very much. Pleasure. Where go next one? Yes, next dressing room next. Dressing door. room next door. Good. Hello.
Uh, and this is the dressing room. And these furniture, the furniture as well. Let's see the make. Yeah, they are. The dressing room, design room, bathroom sit between the two large bed chamber. I you know this one was room pink bathroom was at 1957. Mary Lotti, my brother Henry and Wiley, and modern bathroom and decorated by Mary who used crown wallpaper. The sipping bird cage among the folded and wallpaper you see had been installed by National Trust of Scotland. Please pause to read if you want. The Mechanism of Robert Lotima marble side table had... Oh, he, he that the gentleman we were talking about early on. Table there. Sorry about that. Number one, because I mentioned about six sons, remember six children? That could be them. You can be seen in Loreto School team photographs standing back left. Hughes. There, number one here, number one, my friend, on the left, the tall one. So, there's a table there. That's Scottish Trisso, you know my friend? I love Scottish Trisso, you see in my uh, symbol. Scottish Trisso. And uh, bathroom quickly. I'm nosy. <laughs> I have to see everything. Nice. Own paper, anyone know? Koyun. Practical household. It's 1956, everyone there. December 1956 and 1959, July. This one there. It's no see how It's about the house. Garden out there, isn't it? Going to the garden later on, my friend. I love painting, old painting, drawing. And this room has. Hi. Hello. Beautiful in here. Is there a bed chamber here? Yes. Yeah, who yes. bed chamber is? Well, this was the Earl of Kelly's bedroom. The the Earl of Kelly is it the last? No. The first or the, the second? The Earls of Kelly go back to the eighteenth, nineteenth, nineteenth century. Yes. Uh huh. Um, this was used as a guest bedroom. Uh huh. By Hugh and Mary Lorimer, who were the last owners. The last before, owner. Yes. Mm -hmm. Before we took it on. They're using this room. They were staying you know, here. Their bedroom was the vine room. The vine room, yeah. The one that just been. This was a guest bedroom. Let's get, oh, beautiful. Let's get below. Look at this drape. Mm -hmm. You know what I like about uh, here? I love plaster ceiling. Yes. I love beautiful design, plaster ceiling. This being done quite unique, isn't it? Look. It's perfect there. Yeah. And one here, it's yeah. the same thing. One on each side. And one on each side there. And one here, I love that's, the figure here. Yes, that's the marriage coat of arms of the third Earl of Kelly and his second wife. It's the same as the one in the drawing room. Yes. This half moon there. Mm -hmm. Beautifully done, isn't it?
furniture as well. Yes. And the curtain, nicely done curtain as well. Yes. They decided this, the this, color. Well, this wall is material. Mm -hmm. uh, and the original curtains at the side, because the material didn't quite fit, mm -hmm. they were red velvet. Yes. But they have disintegrated. Oh, so see, they put we, we this had one, to put new, gold new ones. ones on. This is National Trustly Places. The National Trust put the little curtains and the pelmet. Or oh, the pelmet. But the material here, that was Mary Lorimer. Mary Lorimer. Yeah. Okay. And uh, the next door, what is that? Uh, th this is another tower. There uh -huh. are three rooms in the tower, mm -hmm. but you've got to study through there. I go study well. first and then study I go. Study first and then. Okay. Upstairs. Okay, thank you. <laughs> Quick study. <laughs> Quick study, have a look. Wow, this room is nice too. Robert Lotima study room. This was original L of Kelly dressing room and still had 17th century plaster work in, in the 1950 it was turned into the Bob's room by Hughes and Mary Lotima, who children remember it being one of the coldest rooms in the house. Oh, because the last room maybe that's why it's cold. That's the one we just went in, 1950 there. You have time, please post it, my friend. What is that there? Oh, look what we're going to design house. Furniture, textile that pay homemade to this room, country rich in, in history and decorative scheme. And number two, who's lady number two? Number one, writing desk. That's number one we just seen. And number two, Robert Weiss, Violet and Alicia Why? in her wedding dress, 1903. Robert designed the furniture. Especially for Violet, for Violet, and including the tea table design display room and corner cabinet that contain Robert collect for the Violet while traveling in Europe. And number three, detail the tapestry on one or two small chairs and display board designs by Robert and the favorite gift of item gave to the children in the family. Okay. Robert Lotima, 1929, gentlemen here, hang on, too close, it's a defect in the mirror, you can see better this way, that's Robert Lotima, who the gentleman who's architect, I believe, and there's a table, we're talking about on the side, I put a side to it, Tea table, that must be this big drawing. The, uh, this spoon. That has some certificate. So what in this cabinet? It's a glass defects in my friend. It's very really hard to see if you stand further away. Mm, still can't see very well. This for the old tray, isn't it? Tap and feel, look and learn. This is the coldest room in the house. And look at those furniture here. Beautiful. Who oh, this? Robert, Robert Lotima. You can't see again. Janet, number one, Janet Lotima. That's number one. And number two, Margaret Lotima, number two there, and number three, 
Janet Webster and number four Catherine Webster number five Margaret Webster that's number five Kelly Castle See the architect the drawing isn't it? I said the drawing of the pin very prints the print This be the drawing as well furniture with the cottage so on the top past three now you can see me the boy you can see reflection Upstairs. There's three rooms, one at the top, the blue room, and then keep going down the stairs. So it's one room here, there's two rooms down there. One room at the very top, mm -hmm. then there's this blue room, mm -hmm. and then there's another room with paintings. Okay, so then we get out that way? Yes, you okay. find yourself back at the beginning. Okay, <laughs> thank, thank you, thank you very much. So two rooms up here, the blue room here. information here. Look like a nursery room. It's called here. Mm -hmm. I love this sculpture. And the mirror. And the bird, see the bird's sculpture, amazing. That's the best. Read a drawing there. Would you like to sit here and draw a picture? Sleeping baby, Hannah Lotima. 1877 drawing or oh, sleeping here huh? so Hana Lotima is sleeping in this bed pink fire please beautiful little room isn't it I love looking at painting you guys bought my video look at the painting beautiful Look like uh, one the owner of the house. No got a pit, no got a name on it. Beautiful mirror, isn't it? This room's plain, my friend. Plain. You see ceiling, they got a plaster, beautiful, but this one is plain. Loom card, okay. Blue room. This is the south. This is the southwest tower. The castle which was complete in 1606 and built to create more spacious accommodation for guests. He and Mary daughter Monica used this room at her bedroom. Monica chose the blue room, decoration and the pink and blue ornament, and were informed by the color in the fireplace. Yeah, we seen the pink one. This portrait, my friend, you got a minute. Thanks very much. This room we just seen. Again, I love looking at the picture. And got an angel there in the behind her back. Got an angel, isn't it? And we go up some lap first. So, yeah. Not and this one, wow, this is a top room, I mean, that's a garden, oh, that's where the room there, see the garden up there, and there, and there 
is uh, as a pay room, I, I imagine. Oh, so cute. Look at the pay shoe there. 16th century. And look at the card. Look at the card. Oh. Oh. Memory, isn't it? Having tea, I don't know if it can be. Beautiful. Children pay beautiful or the figure. Okay, what is this? Oh. In the drawer, closed door. Furniture. Oh, that's so cute. Look at this. Beautiful. And she sat by the window there. Sat by the window there. I love another car, so they got a seat by the window. And if you look down to the beautiful day outside. Look, my friend, how beautiful day is that? Look. How beautiful outside, but it's freezing cold, by the way. Beautiful, beautiful view. See the view there, it's beautiful. There's a sea there. And you see another room? Oh, the little door, little chairs, and little bed. Oh, how beautiful. Door sitting on a tiny chair. And the one behind there. And the bird. Oh, they're not real. But imagine the one day probably be real. So, and they got a sticker here. Beautiful, isn't it? It's a beautiful sticker. Sticker by the children, they have their own thin bookshelf there. Hundred of sticker, seen that two panel. You know, the one like, you know, one like, look at the sticker. Beautiful. I like it. It's fireplace. That's one of the children. Beautiful. Beautiful children. It's a children bed. Ah, there's a card somewhere. Oh, there's a card. Room card. Children room, yes. You know children room, but which one? We have to lead to the top of the southwest. Tower is complete 1606. Create accommodation for guests as you enter the room. Leave you the five Jacobin decoration and feather thing that indicate that maybe in the same period of the 1617 plus the work of the library, the one we just seen. This is the bedroom for he and Mary, middle child. Henley, Mary of this item room, but decorated 1981. The cook set a nursery, the item of make for children in a Lotima family are John Henley, Robert and Lotima. Robert make the <coughs> make the bedroom to the make this bedroom with a carving angel on the head book. and for his grandson Robin, how many elder son would bedroom? Okay, this be John Henley. And toy on the floor are to be displayed with object. The soap. What to leave in the one you're interested? 
Don't forget this is 16 or 6. Yeah. Okay. Thank you very much for reading that, my friend. We're gonna go up to the we go up to the the floor. The last floor will be our art room down there. Ooh, I don't like that. I put it over. And we might look at the card first. This is what bedroom for Hugh and Mary, elder child Robin had been turned into an exhibition space for celebrate the work of John Henry Lottima. The furniture is by his brother Robert Lottima, the architect one. John Henry Lottima was influenced by his... And he was 22. When the family leased the castle to the Elma or Anne Kelly, the boy who had been giving us studio on Edinburgh family home and was also given one of uh, here at Kelly. John Henry studio was installed in 1879. The sister can be seen recreate today. Okay, please put to read if you... If they're talking a lot about the... People in the family, the old gifted, the old architect, the old very gifted people. I don't know who that is. I can't see the name. There's no name in it. Oh, that's very cute. I'm good there. Lovely painting, isn't it? With the uh, relaxing the chair. The color fire china, cuddly plate. John Henry Lotima after the game board. Mrs. Graham painted 1874. I've not got a name on that one. Yes. This is the when we walk in, remember? We walk in here and we walk part to get here. So there it is, where all the, they were looking at the cleaning. Beautiful. And who are you, sir? Mm. They love the dog spaniel. See the one in the ceiling? We are early on talking about the loy. The furniture. Okay. This is the last room. This last room, I think. We go out here, maybe. See the way we came back in. We came back in here. We came up here and went in there. That's the way we're going up. Thank you very much for watching, dear friend, everyone. Kokunumar Khati Kamadu. Ani Tua Sutaika. This is the last 
tour today and it's our last room we going out there going outside now even thanks very much for watching